Virginia lost its last three ball games to Virginia, Rutgers, and Temple, but tonight they're playing like they did in the earlier part of the season when they were very healthy. That is Brown in motion to the left side. On the dive, it is Wolfley, the fullback, stopped by Turner, number 93, the defensive right tackle, a junior out of Houston, Texas, and West Virginia's inside the TCU 10. It's a third down and inches to go for West Virginia, the ball inside the 10. Harvey Smith splits wide to the left side. Wolfley has the first down at the five. First and goal to go. Stopped by Gary Spann, the linebacker, number 57. Out as the wide out. And Mullen goes in motion for West Virginia. On the dive, straight ahead, goes the fullback, Wolfley, number 36. He is stopped by Darren Turner after a yard or so. And it'll be third down and goal to go, coming up from about the three-yard line of TCU. And here come the Mountaineers. An inside handoff going to Wolfley, the fullback. And Wolfley, look at him run, will you? Out of bounds, chased out of bounds to the 42-yard line. It's a first down for West Virginia on a pickup of 16 yards by hard-running Ron Wolfley, number 36. And the blocker was his tailback, John Gay, number 46. Mullen in motion, being covered by Sean Thomas, who goes to his side. The handoff gets very little as Gerald Taylor comes up to make the tackle. It was Ron Wolfley, number 36, the co-captain and fullback, getting out to about the 12-yard line. It'll be second down six, giving him four yards. Of turn this year. 74 yards against Pitt. He is a big play man. Play action beautifully by White. Throwing. And it is caught by Wolfley coming out of the backfield. He is down inside the five of the three-yard line. Brought down by Billy Jones. It'll be first and goal to go in a 22-yard pickup there. And West Virginia will have the ball of the TCU five. Well, TCU's playing an awful lot of man coverage. When you're in man coverage, you're going to get a lot of isolations with backs against mismatches. And that's, they've stuck uh, Wolfley out of the backfield there. You saw the linebacker. The span that was trying to and, uh, throws. He's got another touchdown to Wolfley. Well, the West Virginia offense is just doing a lot of things with the passing, passing game. Really a lot of pro ideas to this. You see the motion play. Watch him fake in here. See the fake the counter play. Now as he's coming across in here now, he just lobs it after Wolfley sliding out into the flat. They're crossing people, crossing back, making that back come from the far side. Now the linebackers come all the way across to make this coverage. Very difficult coverage from TCU standpoint. You see him chasing them, you see him pointing them out. Man for man, they're doing a lot of crossing in the backfield. Steve Superick, Supi back to do the punting. And Byron Linwood. And they go to the little surprise and what they may be. Virginia decides, wait a minute, we got a 28-7 lead, we got 52 seconds to go in the first half, and Wolfley carries it for 24 yards and a first down. Just a great call. They were in a great position to make the play. Kind of a safe, unexpected type play. You, you know if you don't make it, you know that they still have a long way to go with less time to go in the play. They just snapped the ball to the up back then. They snapped it to the up back, and he ran it with some good block, and here's the shot of it. See it go to the fullback. Like an old single wing type play, the kick out of the outside, but a missed tackle. If they make the tackle, they don't make this big game. 